I'm about to taste the most expensive cup of coffee in the world. This cup of joe will set you back, wait for it, a whopping 90 bucks. What makes it so special? It's brewed from a coffee bean called the Kopi Lua, harvested, believe it or not, from what your cat leaves in the litter box. We're not kidding. The Indonesian civet cat eats coffee cherries. That's what comes off the tree. Then the cat does his business, and the seeds from the cherries are dried and roasted into coffee beans. Jack Nicholson tried it in the bucket list. Kopi Luwak, the rarest beverage in the world. And now I'm giving it a taste. It's very smooth. $90 may seem pretty outrageous for a cup of coffee, but exclusive and very expensive coffee is growing in popularity. And now Starbucks is getting in on the pricey coffee craze with a new chain of high-end coffee shops. Fox business anchor Trish Regan. People love coffee, and they're willing to spend a lot of money on it. This Starbucks store in Manhattan even goes by another name. It's a Starbucks reserve store. Here, a cup of coffee starts at $4. And if you opt to have it brewed by the siphon method, a technique that actually dates back to the 1800s, that will jack up the price to $10. They're also looking to really cultivate the high-end consumer. Starbucks has become pretty mainstream. It started out as kind of a luxury item. If you're willing to spend $5 on a cup of coffee, that certainly is a luxury. Well, now they want to really exploit that market even more. Can coffee drinkers really taste the difference? We took our pricey coffee to the streets of Santa Monica. I think I like this second one myself. Really? Yeah, I'm a the, milder kind of. That's the dollar coffee. See? <laughs> Most people prefer the cheap coffee. Hmm. No, I think I like this one better. This is the dollar cup of coffee. Really? <laughs>